Nobby vlog. Here with Karma Cormac. With Tata hey Beach in the background. And we're just gonna go for a little ramble. Then get some, uh, some food. bread. Now, I have to tell you that mic is directional. Okay, so you just gotta talk into that. How long do I know you? 15, 18 years. Might be longer, right? Yeah. I think I met you, well, I would have mixed in the same circles that knew each other. So, 1995, we used to go to the kitchen. And then you used to get Keith, remember Keith with the long hair? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And all the boy courier crowd. And I think you used to hang with that crew. That's right, I was sort of on a social scene before the, the art, martial arts scene, yeah. Yeah, they were good old days, weren't they? They were indeed, they were. Do you know where Keith is now? Keith, yeah, he's managing a restaurant in uh, in Dublin. It's at William Street. Right. Jeez, I forget what it's called. Yeah. Still got but, fantastic hair. Yeah, he's, he's, yeah, he's, he's evolved and changed well over the years, you know? Yeah. It's good, great to see. I'm about to drop over and see him when I get in. And then, uh, popped into doing ninjutsu, right? When was that? When did you start ninjutsu? Me, I think I started in 99. 99, maybe. Right. Even before that. Yeah. So I was doing a course in DIT. I'm going to say hello to uh, Nunu over here. Yeah. Hey Nunu! Hey! If you ever want to go kayaking in uh, in Lagos, there's, uh, these are the guys, Easy Ride. Yeah. See you later, brother. Uh, yeah. So as you can see, they're, they're, uh, they love working those guys, right? They brought me yeah. out the other day. It's fucking fantastic. It's, it's good spin, isn't it? Oh, amazing, amazing. Yeah, let's get over here. All right. Yeah, there's um like sometimes you see me walking on the cliffs and there's some grottos there you can go in the canoes. Nunu brings people out. Yeah. And it's a bit of a day. So yeah. Um a lot of my soundtrack of music is down to you. Yeah? Yeah. I have um I like to train with music. I have a guy over, Jeff. Jeff Knight from Knight Industries at the moment for a year yeah, from New yeah, York. I met him. And he doesn't train with music, he thinks it's a little bit strange. But well, for me, it's, uh, it makes me kind of relax, and I think I get more out of training if I have got music. That's a and huge you, part of it. Yeah, yeah you got yeah. me into Red Snapper. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I never heard of them, so if you haven't heard of Red Snapper, check it out. What would you say they are? What are they? What type? Yeah. Of music. Oh, plinky, plonky, experimental, cool, groovy, weird stuff. <laughs> it is, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. And what about, what are you doing now, life boys and martial art boys and just in general? Uh, train with, train out of Primal MMA, Owen Ruddy. Been training there for maybe a year or two now. Um, took a break from martial stuff. Did a lot of CrossFit with the, the Ronan CrossFit boys is doing. One of the best video blogs out there. Absolutely, He's also yeah, pimped up yeah. his camera. Oh, they're, they're, they're on it, those, you know, Jody and Eamon, they're on it, in every way. Um, so yeah, there's great stuff coming out in. Um, and are you, doing, are you doing the CrossFit much now? Or? Yeah, do my own stuff, like, yeah. do, have my own bit of kit at home that I like to do, that complements my Jiu-Jitsu and complements my fitness, you know? Yeah. I don't go down to the box much. Um, don't like to go really heavy on lifts, you know. Yeah. Like to use weight, but not not too heavy. I sort of, I suppose it's like anyone. You find your own groove. You take little bits of stuff that you like from stuff, and you you bring them with you into the, you know, the next thing. So, plus, I much prefer jujitsu training jits than strength and conditioning or anything else. So I I find personally, I like to keep some energy, more energy for jits than. Other stuff, you know. Yeah. So, uh, how often you getting down? But Owen's, Owen's gym. Jeez, I'd get down, you know, three, four, five times a week. Right. So, it's a great little. Great he is good, Owen, isn't vibe. he? Yeah, it's a great vibe in the, in the club. I love it. Um, and my son, then, you know, he trains over in Straight Blast Gym, Concord. How many people believe he's not your son? It's great when they say that we're mates or that we're, you know. <laughs> There's a picture on my door of the gym, if you've been, it, and Carl's in it. It's a poster of one of the camps. And there's this young, small, blonde child with Carl. And now he's not a young, small, blonde child he's anymore. Six four, six, he's six five four. Now. He's fucking huge. Yeah. And uh, he's all about jits and MMA now, right? He is. He loves it. You know, he's looking to, he wants to start getting into the, the, the strike and fighting now, you know. So we'll, 
we let Owen decide when he's ready and stuff like that. He's he mad for the competition, any competition, gi, no gi, jits. He loves doing, he's embracing the whole nutritional part of it, and, you know, foam rolls and stretch, you know, all the other stuff that's very important that people forget about or choose to ignore a lot of the time, yeah. you know, because they just want to go to the gym and hit stuff or hit people, you know, he's... Food-wise, like have he's you changed much in the way you eat, or...? Yeah, yeah, the whole... Yeah, because yeah. you, you've tried most things, right? I've tried mo most things. Yeah. Um, I went very, very strict paleo for a good while, and I don't know whether that suited me. You know, I, I like maybe I'm about eighty percent paleo now. You know, right. I have an ice cream. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> on occasion, or I'll have a sandwich on occasion. But yeah, I eat quite clean, very clean these days. You know, cut all alcohol out of my Perfect diet. Nice to a great extent, apart from last night, yeah. Ooh, Have a little bit of shit, right? To a great extent, yeah. apart from the odd ice cream, but you know, stuff that's you know, inflammatory, just get rid of it, you know? Just just get the good stuff into you as much as possible, and that prolongs your, your training, you know? It, time on the mat is very, very important to me, so like if you're, it's like when we went to Thailand, you know, to train Muay Thai. Yeah. You see the guys out at night drinking cheap Thai whiskey and getting yeah. hammered and then they can't train the next day or they train the next day and they're in bits. That's... I prefer to put that, cut that out and to train more, you know? Yeah. I suppose it's like anything, if you have a love for something, you know, you, you'll sacrifice other things so you can do that more, so... If you had, like, two tips on food, what would you give to somebody? Two tips to give up and two tips to add. To give up, give up wheat and give up sugar. Just get rid of it, you know. And then the odd time, have it, you know. And yeah. then it's it's precious. Then it's like, whoa, this is great. This ice cream's great, but don't yeah. have it every day. It's just, you know. So get rid of that. And to add into your life, I would say, you know, eat more protein, less carbs. Yeah. Good stuff. Obviously, I'm not gonna rant about what's good and what's not, find out yourself, but um, have a look at that balance between how much protein you have versus carbs and get the good fats into it as well, you know? And uh, What fats are you taking? You're away. Just fats from food, mostly. I, I, yeah, don't... I, got, I got to check this little fella out. Hang on. Hey, buddy. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> yeah. So... Yeah, I don't go in for supplements much. Yeah. Because they're quite expensive, <laughs> number one. True. And, uh, you know, it's always a little bit of a one-upmanship. You know, well, I take this and I take that, and this is the new best thing, and da da da. So you just fill yourself with lots of healthy food every day. You're good to go. You know, unless you're obviously competing a lot. I don't compete a lot. If you're, Competing in the cage or on the mat for jujitsu, yeah. Then you bring, you know, you bring your. Oh, I take fish oils. Right. I take uh, ZMA. You know, just yeah. the basic stuff. But, uh, yeah. I, I, I don't try I, I not to usually crazy. take a little bit of deck and winter just to get me motivated <laughs> in the mornings. And uh, usually good to go then after that. You know, yeah. Yeah. chemical and strong, not weak and herbal. <laughs> As the the great Jovan yeah. would say, yeah. figure of eight, fantastic. So, as you can see, wherever you're now, we're in the cobbled streets of Lagos. We're going down for this little spot down here. This is a great little spot. It's um, a traditional bread, even though we said we don't eat wheat. Uh, don't punish yourself with food, is what I think. Have what, when you feel like something, have it, you know? Yeah. And uh, just enjoy your food. Don't, it's not, it shouldn't be punishment. It should be a reward more so than having a punishment. How you doing? Good stuff. Very popular, obviously. That's what happens. And no one's asked me for drugs yet, Carol. Have you noticed that? Yeah, I was laughing. I was walking around town, the town, with Keelan. Yeah. He's been over with me the last couple of days. He's gone back now, you know? Yeah. And uh, there's a good few times people have come up to him and asked him, do you want drugs and stuff like that? And we're laughing. Just, they haven't asked you, do you want any drugs? Yeah, said, I'm too old now, you know? <laughs> do you well, want to ask me? Well, I complained in the cop shop one day, and, I, and I, he said, well, you kind of look like someone who'd want some drugs. <laughs> <laughs> What's that mean? <laughs> you know, so... Uh, yeah, this little spot we're going into, it, they, they um, cook the bread on a fire with, with sausage in it, traditional, and soup. Uh, remember we were talking we about kale? Some of that. Yeah, kale. Cal Verde, yeah. so yeah. they call it Cal Verde here, so this is like a kale soup. Cool. So a bit of good, a bit of bad. I don't know if they'll allow me to film it here. Yeah, they will, yeah. 
Now I just set this up here. Boom. So yeah, facial recognition. Um, yeah, we'll come back to this in a minute. Probably a fool with that steak on a stone last night. Whoa. If you ever get over here and try the steak on a stone, he'll show you where it is. It's amazing. The, the steak is cooked in front of your eyes on a hot stone. Unbelievable. Yeah, if you've been delicious. here, you've had uh, everyone has been to the steak on a stone. I don't even look at the menu, I don't know what's on it. Hola, how are you? You're Hello. good? I'm doing, yeah. the, I'm doing a video vlog, is that okay? This is Alicia, she's really nice. Say hello. She's, uh, she's uh, can we get uh, two mini menus? So yeah, um, next week you're heading back to Primal? Yeah, I'll be on the mat on Monday morning. Say hello to the Roddy. Very well indeed. Uh, he needs to come down. I know, we need to get a group over. Uh, really Cal Verde, uh, 10 Falcon Can. Delish. I'll have what he's having. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so that's uh, my little bit of Portuguese. I do Jiu Jitsu and bread in Portuguese, and that's about it. So, yeah, so we'll just rock up here. We're going to have some food. And, uh, anything you want to say? Music wise? Recommendations? Anything I want to say music wise? Um, no, can't think of anything right now. I mean, I just love landing on to the likes of your gym or in my own gym and I just love what, listening to what other people play now these days as opposed to me and yeah. sort of finding music for the yeah. first time. It could be 20 years old, it could be yeah. 100 years old. If you've heard it for the first time it's like, it's brilliant, you know? My, so I love that. My recommendation would be probably Womack's last album where he went from Blur. Oh yeah, you are telling me. I was listening to a little bit there the other day. Yeah, brilliant, it's brilliant. Do you want to drink? Um, water, please. Agua, contash, good water. Still. Still, and one with the fizz. One with the fizzy. One with the fizzy. And my other one would be, uh, what's the guy's name who shot his, his father shot? Marvin Gaye. Marvin Gaye. Yeah. Marvin Gaye. Uh, check out. Uh, Troubled Man. Best album ever. Yeah, yeah. I would buy the camera, finally. So tell, tell the boys and girls. What type of camera are you going to buy? Yeah. She's shy. You're going to get Canon? Yes. What type? I don't know. It's a Canon yeah. with yeah. your... No! Yeah. 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 Okay. <laughs> okay, anyway, till the next one. Hashtag Rafter. Uh, See you guys. Rafter. <laughs>